Expert knowledge under the topic of tax was discussed at the second annual tax symposium, which is organized by the Faculty of Taxation of the Institute of Chartered Accountants of Sri Lanka. A panel discussion was held with the participation of economic experts, Dr. Nishant Imel, Executive Director of Verity Research, Murtaza Jafarji, CEO of JB Securities Limited, Economic Advisor to the Ministry of Finance, Deshal Timel, PKG Harish Chandra, Director, Economic Research Department of the Central Bank of Sri Lanka, and Bingumal Tevatantri, CEO of Standard Chartered Bank. If you treat debt rollover by simply postponing when that debt will become due, all we do is we kick the can down the road. We meet the target for the next five years, next eight years, 2033 to 38, you, you then pile up your gross financing needs. So we need to solve this problem, not just for the IMF program duration, but for all time. That's a sustainable solution because otherwise the closer you get to the horizon of 2032, the more precarious your economy will look and people will start reacting to that risk and uncertainty well in advance. Markets are good at spotting that. So it's uh, cutting coupons is not a gross financing needs, uh, question. Uh, cutting coupons is really about also piling up the quantity of your debt uh, and debt to GDP. And I think the comment I made is cutting coupons for the central bank uh, doesn't do the trick enough. We must cut it to the market uh, because central bank is fully owned by the government. Towards next year, you start to see more kind of uh, demand, uh, demand picking up, largely supported by a lower, uh, lower interest rate regime. But more importantly, the fact that inflation has, uh, has, has come down as well. It's very important that you're not going to see this continued spiral of, pri of, uh, of prices increasing. That stabilization will also allow wages to gradually catch up. Um, and, uh, and then, of course, you're also seeing uh, a greater degree of stability in terms of, uh, in terms of the currency as well. So all of those factors, I think, will combine to enable, uh, to enable demand to pick up in a, in a bigger way in, uh, in 2024. Uh, and beyond, but it will it'll be a fairly gradual process. Attending the event virtually, senior economist of the World Bank, Alistair Thomas, spoke about the tax policy principles across countries. High-income, low-income countries, there is very inconsistent and, and incoherent taxation uh, of, across different asset types. Now, that is sometimes intentional. Uh, countries will typically provide significant uh, tax favorable treatment to private pensions, for example, with EET systems that, uh, that provide deductions or credits upfront for, for contributions made to pension, private pension schemes. Uh, and then we'll have even potentially concessionary tax taxation on, on, on final sale, uh, sorry, on final payments, uh, pension payments uh, to, to retirees. Uh, and, and these can actually result in negative effective tax rates being imposed.